Tuesday with TechNewsZone.com, coming to you from Las Vegas, Las Vegas Strong. I'm an Army vet, Aspie tech blogger, I love 3D printing, I love 3D tech. Uh, my goal is to help education via technology, special 3D technology. Uh, teacher in training, presently I've been uh, guest teaching. Right now I'm testing out this awesome CubaBot. So far I'm really, really impressed with it. I printed out a um, Veroni Bear on it, which is the very first printer I've ever printed a Veroni Bear with no supports. And it came out beautifully. Um, so look at that. And it's not a uh, SLA printer, it's a th uh, FTM printer that did it. Right now I'm printing out a Furling Tech uh, 3D filament holder to hold the Filament Tech 3D filament. That uh, looks like one of those, a blue one. That was printed in Storm 3D. This one's printed in Mamarubot Natural PLA. Uh, which we got from Data Fab in the United States, where we are. They sent us a two kilogram roll of the Mamarubot natural PLA, huge roll for us. And, we're, and it's printing on the, uh, the Furling Tech from Kickstarter uh, 3D filament holder on our um, CraftBot Plus we got from them. It's on loan, um, it's pretty nice. We're gonna be also uh, testing a few other things coming soon, but right now we're messing with this one. And we still have the G-Tech E180 as well, um, which I'm actually testing out the Furling Tech 3D PLA um, but they're interesting. Uh, they're the ones with this new mechanism for uh, keeping the filament in line, and also the filament. These little miniature small rolls, and then also they have the little holders that they have to hold the three D uh, filament. So, but right now uh, on the Craftbot, my bad, uh, it's printing out the Furling Tech uh, filament holder, and this printer's been doing an awesome job. I print out this little see this giraffe. That's our lovely snap maker. Right now I'm using the snap maker mostly for lasering. Laser engraving it does an awesome job with 3D printing and laser engraving, but since we have the big one right now, I'm using that one for 3D printing, the G-Tech for printing, but this one for um, the lasering at the moment. This little blue giraffe was also printed on the CraftBot Plus. Uh, Craft Plot. Um, I didn't think I used any support, so I might have. Uh, it's in Storm 3D Blueberry PLA. I, of course, got this from Thingiverse. The Furling Tech model I got from Furling Tech. The Veroni Bear I got from... Furling Tech, I don't know where they got it from, they might have made it, but this came from Furling Tech. Uh, no, it came from CraftBot, my bad. This came from CraftBot, these both came from CraftBot. Also, shout out to Lenovo for giving us this yoga to borrow. My, my bad, I'm like, it's a Legion 920, my bad. So we're borrowing a Legion 920, I'm doing 3D printing and gaming with it. We've been using it to print on their printers and do the um, Simplify 3D on it. Shout out to Simplify 3D, love you guys. Uh, love Storm 3D, CraftBot's amazing. We're going to be getting an iMade 3D uh, to test, review, build. It will help with my educational things. And maybe I'll see how that goes. I haven't got it in the mail yet, but when we get it, we're going to build it, and that'll be awesome. But this CraftBot is one of the best printers I've ever messed with. It prints beautifully. It doesn't mess up that much, hardly ever. All 3D printers mess up some, but this one's beautiful. The quality is just like over the top. I think any printer with a bottom doesn't move. The base doesn't move and just the head moves will give better output in my perception. But this thing is so far is amazing. Um, uses Kapton tape on the hot end, I mean on the heating bed, heat, the heated bed. And then also these little, these little things unhook and the whole plate comes out so we can take the, the objects off easier. But we're very, 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 very impressed so far. And I like the reddish orange color too. Uh, one of my two favorite colors. So, uh, very awesome printer. Of all the printers I've so far tested, uh, the G-Tech's doing a good job, the Snapmaker does a good job, uh, my son's Tier Time Upbox Mini 2, we've had it for a long time, uh, works fairly well, but this CraftBot Plus is amazing in terms of quality. Uh, ours is, I don't know how other ones are, but the one we have has not let me down at all. And it's got a heated bed, you can do PETG, you can do PLA, you can do the ABS on it. There's a little adapter you can get from Thingiverse to let you do uh, flexible, which I haven't tried that yet. We will, but we had this on loan for a while. If I was rich, I'd buy it, uh, but it's pretty uh, awesome. Dave with TechNewsZone.com in Las Vegas, coming to you April the 16th, 2018, talking about a few of our printers and showing off the CraftBot printing the Furling Tech 3D filament holder. Signing out. Later. <laughs>